hi all so in this video you know uh, we can see how we get the customer statements you know in out of the box order so without doing any customization or custom orders you know how we can simply uh, get the customer statements uh, from a default order even it is community or enterprise so here you can see i have created a customer technorius and uh, if you go to here you can see a small button called invoiced so here you will be getting the total invoiced amount for this particular customer if you click on this you will be getting the invoice number with the filter as not paid so if you remove this filter you can see all the invoices made for the customer technorius and uh, you will be getting the invoice number here invoice date here and the tax excluded and you know taxes total amount due the status payment etc so if, if, you, if you click on these three bullets now you will be getting all the fields what you need actually the voice date will be there and due date will be there if you want the source document or reference you can tick this and the main thing is tax excluded what is the tax excluded amount what is the tax amount what is the total amount what is the amount due and uh, so you'll be getting all the information so as a statement for the statement you will be getting uh, all this and here you will be getting the sum of you uh, know tax excluded value sum of tax sum of total amount sum of the due amount so if you want to uh, you know specifically group for any period and all now what you will be getting if you go to filter and if you click on the invoice date here you will be getting different filters like you know specific month november specific month october specific month september like this and uh, if you want a quarterly basis then q1 q2 q3 q4 you'll be getting here if you want for a separate financial year you'll be getting the filters here similarly even you can group by the month or date with the invoice here uh, if you do this way you'll be getting all the invoices which is made in the month of november okay so i believe that without using any custom module or any third party models now we'll be getting customer statement this way so i i hope you all enjoyed this video thank you